Hi, I'm Chris Cudmore, founder of Relative Digital Marketing, and I am excited to announce the release of the ultimate SEO auto template. Now you can get the same template that I've used to impress interviewers, land high paying SEO jobs, and I've made tens of thousands of dollars conducting audits in just the few months that I've had my own business. Not to mention this template has helped in converting 90 plus percent of the companies to monthly services following the audit review call. People just love it. Let's take a look. I originally created this as a coaching template to teach small to medium sized business owners and new SEOs how to audit and even implement optimizations by structuring the information in a way that's you know a little easier to follow. As you can see uh, there's an overall SEO score displayed at the top which doesn't take into account the severity of any issues but rather records the amount of audit points with a passing grade. And that is based off of these check marks here. As you can see, it changes slightly when you click on them. The top section here just pro provides a high-level competitor overview when it comes to backlinks, organic keywords, and organic traffic. You can get these numbers from tools such as Ahrefs or SEMrush. Uh, you should be able to find that all that information in there. The next three sections are for local SEO. If you're not auditing a local site, you can either remove these sections or just mark them all as good and move on. Checking off each task crosses off and dims the text so as not to be distracting from the implementations that need to be completed. Checking off certain tasks will also sometimes update the graphs to the right. Uh, the, an example would be down here, as you can see as you check more of these off, then you see that the graph changes there. The other graphs are updated using the fields that have zeros or numbers in them. For example, if we look at these reviews, uh, there's 23 out of 50. If we change this to 45, obviously it updates the graph. Now, say you're you're optimizing a niche that um, has way over this amount. Let's say a, a medical niche. They often have uh, several hundred different reviews. And so if you notice that the competitors have higher review count, you just change this maximum number. It should have at least number, and it will update the graph accordingly as well. Hovering over the majority of the tasks to the left will provide you with more information on the tasks, such as the importance of the ranking factor, explanations, and sometimes how-to's. Some of the text to the right also updates when certain criteria is met. For example, if we look here, need to optimize for site speed if possible because we're at 3.4 seconds. So if we change that to 2 seconds, you can say it says, whoa, that's pretty fast, and now you're in the green zone. Just as a side note, the server speed is also in seconds. So you can see if this is 432 milliseconds, so you have 0 0.432. And as you can see, there is uh, about 200 audit points on this audit template. And again, you just fill out the numbers accordingly, put the check marks for anything that, that has a passing grade, and it covers uh, tons of stuff in here. Also, there are buttons throughout this template. And these buttons, if you click them, they run a quick script, and it will open the tool that you're that you need to complete that section. Uh, the first time that you use this, uh, these buttons, it'll ask you to allow it. You may even have to hit advance and say OK in order to allow the sheet to access your uh, Google account. Once you've completed the main part of the template, you can create a priority list on the next tab over. That way you can prioritize the task based on importance and ease of implementation as well as create new tabs for mapping the technical SEO issues to their solutions. If you purchase this template, you will get all updates I add to the template moving forward. To learn more about this template or to purchase it, head to the link above or below depending on which platform you're viewing this on. And of course, don't forget to like and subscribe or follow me if you'd like to see more content from me. Thanks. Thanks.